yesterday i got a news clip we there was a claim saying that karni sena had installed a statue uh, near the frontest piece of sankwal and then i it was followed by a video where a man was making a bald man was making a speech there saying that this has been a restoration of after 500 years a statue has been uh, put up over there i thought this was outrageous i think this is completely wrong this same man i saw him in mapsa trying to arouse communal uh, passions and i came to know later on that this man is uh, by name santosh singh rajput and this man came at about 3 o'clock in the night on 18th august and he had done this mischief this frontest piece of sankwal the church which has fallen the frontest piece is a protected monument and it stands on land which is belonging to the fabrica of the church of sankwal the government has notified that the frontest piece also as a heritage site and monument and in private property the government has recognized it as a private property i think what this man has done is completely wrong i called up the police inspector and asked him because i saw a video that yesterday the villagers had gathered over there and i if i had known i would have also gone to the site but i saw that video this morning and i came to know that uh, the police was saying that uh, they would have to invoke section 41a and give him notice so i called up the pi this morning and asked him what section was uh, uh, was uh, attracted in the matter and which they had imposed and they said they had uh, uh, filed a case of trespass and i then went to see the parish priest for the kenneth and at that time the pi with along with his officers were there i told the pi in no uncertain terms that what he had done was wrong they should have booked this man for uh, communal hatred for his inflammatory uh, manner in which he has come to trespass upon the church property and create communal tension goa is peace loving we goans never believe in hurting anyone and i will tell you one thing no true goan will do this kind of a thing i told the pi that you have to take action in accordance with law it has to be swift this man santosh singh rajput has to be arrested there can be no two ways about it and all those others who were there on the site also should be arrested for try to create communal disharmony in our beautiful goa and this kind of things will not be tolerated by us any community we should know how to respect each and every community and we will not tolerate insult or any outrage caused to any other community so i have told the pi that we will watch what is being done if necessary i even told the parish priest that i will always be there to fight for truth and justice and to ensure that communal harmony is maintained and i told him that if the pi does not take this matter seriously and does not pursue it to make sure that this kind of criminals are arrested then i we will have to move the court and ensure that the pi will have to answer for his lapse father kenneth has given me copy of the complaint which they have filed from where i have seen the names of the persons whom i have mentioned uh it and i expect the police to now add this sections which men are mentioned in this complaint and to also take action in accordance with law but before i wind up i appeal to each and every true goan not to fall into this trap of communal hatred or communal division this is very symptomatic at the time of elections and we know that next year parliamentary election is coming up even at my election they were trying to use this kind of tricks to try to divide people on communal lines thank god and thankfully people did not fall prey to these kind of vicious attacks i ask everyone every true goan to make sure that we should maintain peace and harmony i for my part always appeal to everyone to ensure that we are having communal harmony as true goa otherwise goa will be finished so my appeal to you is please make sure that we don't get excited by these kind of things but we will also not tolerate people who misbehave and think that they can take us for granted